In today's press review, we begin with South Africa's Mel and Guardian is a story, Extrovisual Dishes the Dead. Another story is Denel Secret 6.3 billion Rand export deal. Struggling state-owned military technology and defense company, Denel, has clinched a 6.3 billion Rand export deal, but the details are still being kept secret after its presentation before Parliament Public Enterprises Portfolio Committee this week. A story in the standard says BBI keeps counties, reduces MPs to 210. Another story is drug linked to death of pregnant women. Poor quality oxytocin, a drug used to stop excessive bleeding in pregnant women, has been linked to high maternal mortality. Excessive bleeding or postpartum hemorrhage, PPH, is responsible for 40% of maternal death two in every five minutes in the country, as per a 2017 Ministry of Health report. The Guardian carried a story captioned, Senate insists on probing alleged 263 billion Naira fraud at Lagos port. The Senate had described as irreversible a decision to investigate alleged financial infractions by security outfit at the Lagos port worth about 263 billion Naira. We end with the new vision is a story captioned Drug Theft, Most Wanted Suspect Nated. Another story says mining companies cry out as their exports are banned. Mining companies are facing financial and operational challenges following a Ugandan Revenue Authority notice to stop the export of unprocessed mineral ores. The seven-month-long running ban has hit companies with export permit, causing them to pile up their stocks in stores.